Hi everyone, thank you so much for joining me. I have another gift basket today, and um, today I have decided to put my gift basket in this beige looking basket. It has a lid. Here's the lid. But instead of doing uh, the traditional um, shred, I did put red shred at the bottom. I got these little plaited um, sheets. This is all from the Dollar Tree. And I wanted it to look more like a gift basket because uh, the scents that I'm playing with today is the apple and cinnamon. This is the Bolero set. And um, I have this hand wash. This is the body cream. I have the body oil. The facial wipes. This is the Bolero um, soap. These are really good soaps. And I have a facial mask. This is not apples and cinnamon. This is pomegranate and gogi berry. Um, I'll show you how I'm gonna do that. And since this is apple and cinnamon, I got this artificial apple from the Dollar Tree. I already nipped the tag off. You can kind of see where um, it was stuck in there. And then I got this bag of cinnamon sticks, also from the Dollar Tree. And I tied three together. This red and white string came from this uh, three pack of string that they also sell there. And um, they sell these little puffs, these bath puffs. They come three in a set, um, sometimes different colors. So I'm gonna go ahead. I've already, so I've already stuffed it. <clears throat> I laid um, a piece of the checkered, actually it's called waxed basket liners and there's 15 of them in here. And I laid one across, I put red stuffing on the bottom and this is gonna be on the top because I wanted it to look like a picnic basket. And since this one comes with a lid, I'm gonna stick the lid in the back here. There, now, um, let's see. One moment. Okay guys, I, um, I'm gonna go ahead and do it like this. I shoved the poof right here. Um, I'm trying to tuck it in on the side so it doesn't come out. And then the apple is gonna be right here, but what I'm gonna do is stick a glue dot right here on the side of the basket because the apple keeps coming up. All right, I stuck a glue dot on the side of the apple and then on the back I was thinking, so it doesn't look so plain, I was gonna stick this facial mask right here that way when the basket is turned um, it looks like you know there's goodies from every angle so I'm gonna do that there now I'm gonna go ahead and shrink wrap it all together to save time I will do that off camera and um, let's see here 
Now this is the bag that you want. This Every single thing you see here came from the Dollar Tree. And you want this shrink wrap and pull bowl. And you want to make sure you find the one that has the blow dryer on it. Um, and you know for sure that's the one that can shrink because they sell other ones that do not shrink. But I'm going to go ahead and shrink this off camera and I'll be right back. All right, everyone, I have shrink wrapped it. This is the front. And this is the back. And that's that mask I put there to kind of break up that that plain beige lid and so this is what it looks like now I have to put the bow on it so I'm going to go ahead and wrap the bow alrighty now here's the bow and it's a pull bow so you just uh, grab the the thinner ribbons on the inside and pull those we're going to make a cute little white fluffy bow here. I'm going to wrap this on Mr. Basket here. Okay. Let me go ahead and wrap this. Alrighty guys, I went ahead and put the bow on it. Now this bow started to come undone so I had to cut part of it off and I tucked it in there and then um, I cut um, part of the top off. I may have cut that part a little bit too short but it still works nevertheless. And um, so again, um, here's the front of the basket. There's the apple and cinnamon there, the soap. All of that. And then the back. I want to thank you guys so much for joining me. And you know what? These baskets, when you put them together with the Bolero products, Bolero is actually... Um, a, quite a nice line. I noticed that um, some of their things are being sold at Bath and Body Works. And if you can get your hands on some of these products and put a basket together, you're really making a really nice quality gift and you're not spending so much money on it. These can be for Christmas or birthdays or mom's days or even teacher gifts. Um, my daughter is putting together like a, a yard sale or something for her school. And um, I'm going to donate a bunch of these baskets so they can sell them and uh, keep the money for their class. Um, but here you go. I want to thank you guys so much for joining me. Please give me a thumbs up and subscribe and I'll see you guys all next time. Bye-bye.